Hey YouTube! Today we're going to learn how to subscribe to File Exchange. The first thing you're going to do is start out at your My eBay. You're then going to go to your Accounts tab, hover over it, and go down to Subscriptions. Now another way that you can get here if you can't get this to populate is to simply click Account and then click Subscriptions. It's going to show you subscriptions that you're already subscribed to, any active subscriptions, and subscriptions still available to you. We want eBay File Exchange. It's very easy. You go over and select Subscribe. You have to agree to the terms and conditions. You can go ahead and read those if you want. I don't care to. Now when you get to this page, the initial reaction is you're going to want to download the File Exchange User Guide. Don't actually click on this one. Click on File Exchange to start using File Exchange. This is your File Exchange Center. Now from here, you're going to go to Instructions and Resources. And you want the second bullet point down, the eBay File Exchange Advanced Instructions. This is a PDF manual. It's extremely versatile. It's searchable. So if you're putting your files together and you're not quite sure what goes in a specific file, you can use this to determine what value you need to use. So click on it. All right. Once you're here, I do recommend saving this to your desktop because you are going to refer to it quite frequently. So desktop location, and save. Now when you go to your desktop, you can see that you have that copy there, so you can use that in the future. Now I know 157 pages of information seems daunting, but you don't have to read it, you know, page 1 to page 157. It's basically just going to be a good resource for you to get involved with. The handy thing about this particular PDF is that, as I said earlier, it is searchable. So let's say you're putting your file together and you're trying to figure out what you would need to use for the action values. You can do a find function by doing control F, type in action, it's going to do a search, and the first thing it finds is understanding the action fields. You can click on this and it'll take you right to the page where it tells you about your action values and how to use them. And that is how you subscribe to File Exchange and also get familiar with the Advanced Instruction Guide. Keep watching for more videos on how to build your eBay arsenal.